Hi friends, here is the fourth type of problem in section formula of coordinate geometry. The question is saying here, find the ratio in which the y-axis, y-axis divides the line segment joining the points 5 comma negative 6 and negative 1 comma negative 4. Also find the point of intersection. Now here, y-axis is dividing the line joined by the these this two points, right? So let me make a rough diagram over here. Uh, fine right this is my x axis this is my y axis this is my origin okay x dash and y dash so it is 5 comma negative 6 so 5 comma negative 6 it is somewhere like this right so let me give this name this point a is 5 comma negative 6 and another point that is minus 1 negative uh, negative 1 uh, comma negative 4 right so uh, let me go uh, minus 1 and then 4 it will be somewhere around like this right so let me give the name this this is negative 1 comma negative uh, 4 right this is point so now this line is a b now this line it's a bit uh, okay now it's right okay so this a b point has been divided by the line uh, this 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 line means this y axis right here this y axis is dividing the point here right this point at this point it is cutting it so now we have to find out the ratio by which this point is cutting this a b right let me give the name of this point p suppose right now uh, we need to find out the ratio as well as the point of this so we know friend uh, we have already learned that in the x axis whole x axis y coordinate is always zero and in y axis always in whole y axis x coordinate is always zero so here the y coordinate uh, will be always zero uh, sorry x coordinate will be always zero in this y y axis so the p point have the coordinate in the form of zero comma y right why let's suppose this distance is y from origin to here it is y so the point uh, is zero y right it, this is in the form of this now we need to find out the ratio also in which it is cutting this right so let me check the ratio that is k ratio 1 right it is k ratio 1 uh, generally in axis uh, if uh, it is cut by the axis somewhere if the line is cutting by the x axis or y axis generally we take the ratio that is k comma 1 right it's generally we take if there will the problem uh, cut by uh, the line cut by the y x axis then also we'll be using the k comma uh, k uh, ratio 1 okay so this is the ratio k comma uh, k uh, ratio 1 now we have to find out the value of this k and the value of this y bar okay so uh, again uh, uh, let me uh, revise the section formula that is x comma y is we have to use here actually section formula by uh, applying this ratios also m1 x2 plus m2 x1 divided by m1 plus m2 and this is x coordinate and now y coordinate is m1 y2 plus m2 y1 whole divided by m1 plus m2 right so here the point of intersection is 0 comma y so it's 0 comma y is equals to m2 here see m1 ratio m2 is equals to k ratio 1 so m1 is here k and m2 is here 1 so m1 right this is m1 so in the place of m1 i can easily write k times x2 so x2 let's suppose this is x2 y2 and this is x1 y1 right so x2 so x2 is here 5 plus m2 is here 1 right here m2 is 1 and x1 x1 is here minus 1 right minus 1 divided by m1 plus m2 that is k plus 1 right now y part right let me write y part y part is again here m1 m1 that is k times y2 that is negative 6 plus m2 right so m2 is here 1 and y1 is here negative 4 all divided by m1 plus m2 that is k plus 1 right see here this 0 is equals to the x coordinate and the y is equals to this this part right so let me find out first uh, let me equate this this part and this part this x coordinate part okay uh, let's call right white color right so this is 0 now just I'm equating this x part right so x coordinate is equals to 5k uh, it will be negative 1 right because 1 times negative 1 it will be minus 1 divided by k plus 1 or 0 times 
k plus 1 is equals to 5k negative 1 or minus 1 right therefore simply we can say when 0 is multiplied by any number the result is always 0 so I can easily write equals to 0 right so 5k negative uh, minus 1 is equals to 0 therefore 5k is equals to 1 therefore k is I can write here r r right so therefore k is equals to 1 upon 5 right we got the value 1 upon 5 so now we need to find out uh, the value of this y right value of this y so simply I'm putting here equating the y part right so let me do it here with a different color okay fine so y is equals to here k times minus 6 plus it will be now not plus because see here it's negative 4 and times 1 so it's negative 4 here right uh, directly I'm writing here it's times whole divided by k plus 1 right or y is equals to minus 6k minus 4 k plus 1 or y equals to, now I'm putting the value of this k that is 1 upon 5 so minus 6 times 1 upon 5 uh, minus this 4 and then again minus 1 then not minus it's plus only 1 upon 5 plus 1 right so or y is equals to see this is 4 negative 4 right so it will be minus 6 upon 5 minus 4 whole divided by right whole divided by 1 plus 5 so it will be 1 and this will multiply this so plus 5 whole divided by 5 or I can write y equals to again minus 6 minus 5 for the 20 20 divided by 5 whole divided by right uh, equals to here whole divided by 6 upon 5 so I can easily cut this 5 and 5 right so therefore I will get here minus 26 divided by 6 this is my y power right so let me cut this 2 13 ja, right minus 13 ja and 2 3 ja. so therefore y is equals to negative 13 upon 3 now we got all the value here right uh, let me go this figure here so here this point is uh, the ratio is here 1 upon 5 ratio 1 this is the ratio by which it is cutting and the 0 and y the point at which the this is intersected this point is here 0 comma minus 13 upon 3 this is the point uh, in which it is being intersected so like this we have to do this problem friend uh, in next video we'll be doing a problem related to the x-axis right there also will be supposing the same ratio that is k ratio 1 right and we'll be doing in the same way it, it will be totally the same okay and if you're watching this from the YouTube or some other uh, websites, I will suggest you to go to the uh, go my website that is s k y i n g s k y n g, right? Blogger dot com, right? Blogger dot com. There I have posted a lot of problem related to the section formula that will really enhance you, that will boost you in this chapter, right? Corner geometry. So please go to this website and try to see this. Uh, it will be more helpful for you. And otherwise you can see uh, there are lots of videos also in if you're wa watching this in YouTube also, right? So this is really simple problem. Simply what we have to do first that just uh, draw a rough diagram and see where the ex exactly the uh, axis is cutting, right? And point that point and then suppose the ratio that is k ratio 1 uh, means the axis is cutting the line in k ratio 1 and then there must be either uh, if x axis is cutting then y part will be 0 y, y coordinate will be 0 and it is cutted by then x axis uh, y axis then the x coordinate will be 0 then equate the x coordinate by, by using the the section formula then you will you will get the value of the ratio right we got the value of ratio that is root uh, uh, means 1 upon 5 uh, uh, ratio 1 that we re recently got here right and then apply the same ratio to find out the value of y coordinate right and then you'll get the value of this point so like this we have to do this kinds of problem we'll be meeting in the next video with the different problem okay bye bye